Hey guys, it's Mary. And it is day four of our Advent calendars. I hope um, you've been enjoying um, the little uh, opening of each of the doors. Um, if so, I hope you've hit that like button. Um, so we always start with Crafter's Companion. And we are looking for four, and it's easy because four, five, and six are all going to be on the same side. So, all right. Let's make sure that this one is so big that you can see. Maybe I'll turn it this way. All right. Ah, looks like another stamp and die set. But look, it doesn't look winter. So that's good. Oh, it's cute. It's a little bouquet. Hold on. Let me get this out of the way. All right. So this is cute little tiny this would be cute in the corner very cute and then the whole die will cut it out so that's very cute i like that i like that it isn't winter but i'm getting a little bit worried that It's, it's beginning to seem like everything is a die and a stamp. And if you remember last year, there were dies, there were stamped and die sets, there was embossing folders. Um, I think there was... And there were stencils, so I'm getting a little worried that they went back to the way they did it a couple of years ago. So, and I like the combination. So, all right, so that is number four for them. And four for Spellbinders is right here. goes with it. See, they don't have the um, the um, aluminum foil, you know, the foil cover to hold things in. This is all in one bag. So I don't think this, whatever this is, I don't think it belongs with this. Oh, but maybe. I don't know. Because this is all coming out of the bag. So, so, let's just take it out of the bag. Happy. And birthday. So, I don't, I don't know what this is. And I'm not thinking it. Well, I don't know. I do not know. So, I don't know. Hold on. We'll see. Okay. I don't know. 
I don't know. The next one, when I put my finger inside, it's in a bag also, but I can't imagine what this would be. So we're just going to go here with the happy birthday. And let's give them a cat and see what they look like. And then I think I'm just going to put this one back in the box and see what comes of the next couple of ones. So I don't know how long Spellbinders has been doing this, but I know this is not their first one. Um, so I am surprised that they don't cover uh, cover each door you know the inside of each door or since they haven't been bags they don't seal the bags because if the bag is there but it's open like I said the other day I can hear things moving around so This is really delicate. Oh, and the H stands alone. It's so tiny. Okay. Okay, hold on. All right, H A P P Y, and the B stands alone. But boy, I do like that uh, font. It's so cute, and it really looks kind of retro to me. This one got a little ripped, but. Um, and then it has the uh, the back. Let me. Um, let's do those so we can see what it would look like with a color on the back. All right. Oh, I love, love the way that is right there with that B. That is adorable. Oh my gosh, that's too cute. Hold on, let me get it centered. All right. All right. There's the H. Oh, I really like that. You know, this reminds me of um, you know, Walt Disney's signature, the way he, that line up there looks, reminds me of it. So, um, love it. Love, love, love this. 
And I'm so glad there's finally a uh, sentiment or saying in one of these. So, I think day number four is a winner. I like them both, and I would use them both, but I do think that I would use the happy birthday sentiment more than I would the flowers. Um, only because the flowers, you know, have to be uh, colored in. So clearly this doesn't belong to anything, so I'm going to put it back into the box and hope Hopefully, let's see. Uh, number four. Hopefully, we'll figure it out by the time we get to eight, because eight is below it, and it's probably where it belongs. So, all right, day four, that's it. So, um, so we've gone through four. Let me know which one's been your favorite um, of the four days um are you liking crafters companion more than um spellbinders or spellbinders more than or kind of equal i think right now uh, it's equal for me um you know i even though i think i would use this one more i do like this one and will use it so i think it's two uh, ties and then one each so far. So I think that's it. Um, yeah, I think that's my vote. So let me know what you think. Um, and um, let me know in comments, like I said, if you have uh, different companies, especially if you have tailored expressions, let me know because that was about $25 more for hers um, than the other one. So let me know what you're getting in it and if it's worth it. Um, and then I'll, you know, pick it up next year. So, all right. So that's it. Day four. Thanks for watching. And I will see you tomorrow for day five. Happy crafting. Bye-bye.